Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Daily Easy English Expression. Today, a phrasal verb to catch up, to be caught up, uh, getting caught up. This is how we use it. Uh, I want to catch up. And this is a great uh, expression, phrasal verb. And what it is, the perfect example is you and your friends, two friends, are going to go to lunch together. So three of you are going to lunch. And your friend says, okay, let's go. And you say, oh, I need to finish this five minutes. You guys go first and I will catch up. Catch up. Okay, so the idea is your two friends, they go first, and then you are behind them, you're behind them, and you catch them, you catch up to them, you go up to them to where they are. So yesterday, or last Friday, we studied uh, to be behind, and now when you're behind, what do you need to do? You need to catch up. This is the idea. It's a great phrasal verb. Check out the dialogue. Oh, yes, I'm finally caught up. What'd you catch up on? Emails. I got behind. Oh, I am so behind. Can you help me? <laughs> yeah. Uh, it's been several weeks since uh, I had that little surgery. But during that time, I have fallen behind on so many things. Email is one area. Coach Shane's ESL, those videos on that channel, that's another area. But I'm starting to get caught up. As I'm physically getting stronger, uh, I'm starting to catch up. And on emails, uh, I'm almost caught up. I'm not exactly caught up. I'm still behind. So yeah, uh, if, if you sent me an email and I didn't respond or somebody on my team didn't respond, send it again. Don't be angry, we're not ignoring you. Go ahead, send it again and uh, we'll make sure we get back to you. So, are you behind in anything? Are you falling behind? You need to catch up? Are you catching up? Is there something you want to catch up on or catch up with. Maybe it's English. You need to catch up with the other people. Maybe at your company or at your school, a couple of the people, their English is really good and you're feeling behind and you need to get up to that level. Yeah, well, right now you're doing a good job. You're studying English. By studying English, it will help you catch up. Studying every day will really help you catch up. Catch up to those people ahead of you. But if they're studying every day too, you need to do more. You might need to do more to catch up. And that's why I recommend my classes. Get my classes for free. www.letsmasterenglish.com slash free. And then join. That's today's expression. It's an excellent phrasal verb. You guys have a fantastic day, and uh, I'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye. Yeah. Oh, yes, I'm finally caught up. What'd you catch up on? Emails. I got behind. Oh, I am so behind. Can you help me? <laughs>、Oh, yes, I'm finally caught up. What'd you catch up on? Emails. I got behind. Oh, I am so behind. Can you help me? <laughs> Oh, yes, I'm finally caught up. What'd you catch up on? Emails. I got behind. Oh, I am so behind. Can you help me? <laughs>